Hello ladies and gentlemen. Right, I'm back on my next adventure. It's been a while. I am heading to Hastings Country Park over to Fairlight. But first of all, we're gonna go meet up with a friend of mine. So let's go find him. I've met up with my friend Dylan, he's just there. I've got my uh, can of Monster and we're gonna uh, chuck all the gear in the car and head off to Hastings uh, Country Park. Right, we are here. It was a very quick journey. We're not too far away from home. Trying to uh, resource all of the uh, local immunities. But it's an amazing view from up here. I don't know if you can see that. But yeah, it's, uh, it's good. We're just uh, heading up onto the east hill now. Dylan's off in front. We have made it to the Glen. Um, we're going to try and head down. A lot of it might be cut off due to landslides. So we've, we're going to come down here. We've come down this way behind us up there. Um, we're going to be heading down that way, which may be a bit steep. So probably best to put the cameras away, isn't it, Dil? <laughs> and uh, so, yeah. Um, Let's see what we can find. The stream down there is the, what we're trying to get to. Um, there was a lot of rain, what, two days ago? So we're hoping that it's got some nice, good flowing water down there. So let's go and see if we can find it. Because um, I think it'll be quite nice. All right, let's make a move. Right, we're just going to talk about why me and Dylan have come out here today. There's a guy on our Facebook who we are part of the same group with, uh, UK Photography, I'll list it down below. Um, and he comes back with these amazing images um, and we asked him where the location was and he basically recommended this place. Um, he gave us the map and everything, he's a really kind guy and we've we basically we're after there's a there's a river down here somewhere I we, we found the opening down here sorry about that uh, really bright um, we found obviously the valley but it's getting down here because there's just so many landslides um, over the last like year that half of all the part well pretty much 90% of the paths leading down here are just gone um, but we have made it actually down to the Glen now so all we've got to do is just find a nice safe route to the river and then fingers crossed we can start shooting some images. I'm after four images today. That's, that's my challenge is four. Um, we've already found one image that we're after, which is right back at the start. That is our sunset image for tonight. Um, so we've got to make sure we're back up there by about four o'clock. Um, so yeah, we're going to keep going this way. We're going to find out and hopefully we can find this, uh, this, this path that we're after. Um, if it's still there, so let's keep going. Right, well, 
Well, we found the stream. It's just below me down there. But unfortunately, it's it's not bringing any images to me. Um, I've taken one uh, or two images down there, which are okay. Uh, the sort of snaps, as, as far as I'm concerned. But this is a scout mission, if you put it. Um, we didn't know what we were really walking ourselves into. We just saw other people's pictures and went for it. Um, so, but what we're gonna do is, we believe there is a reservoir or something up here which feeds this, this little river here, um, but clearly there must be some sort of a dam up there or something that's stopping the flow of the river. So we're gonna head up there now and see what we can get, but I'll, I'll show the images now that I've just taken and uh, see what you think. I mean, they're okay. I, they're all right, so yeah. Let's keep moving. Cool. Right, well we found the reservoir. Unfortunately there is a, uh, a huge door with a lock on it and a fence running all the way around it. So we aren't going to be able to get in there. It's private property and I believe it's for fishing only. So we're going to leave that idea um, and we're going to start heading back on towards maybe the cliff way to see what the uh, sky and everything because we have got one last hurrah and hopefully we're going to try and get this sunset over the whole of Hastings that's our plan um, so yeah it's not been a great day for photography today but we are out and about and that's what it's all about um, if we get an image then it's a bonus so yeah, we're going to start making our way back down towards the cliffs. We're not going to be sure which way we're going to take this. There's loads of little paths back up this way. So but let's see what we can find on the way down. And if we get an image, then it's a bonus. Almost heading to our last location now which is back to where we started but before we decided to go we stumbled upon this place now it might not look much from behind me I'll see if I can focus on it quick there you go all these beautiful trees and I um, I think we've missed the best light for this area I managed to get maybe one image that I was happy with so um, I won't know until I get home though so I'm gonna say yes, but it could be no. So I'm not gonna do much with that one, apart from I will show you now. So yes, I hope you liked it. <laughs> it might not be there, I don't know. But we are going to mark this as a definite comeback location because these trees are amazing. Um, and I think that there's probably more further down, but we haven't got time, so we're gonna head that way um, and we're gonna head off to get this sunset photo and we're gonna probably have to be semi quick as well so yes let's keep going travels back we've just found another little gem um, it's where all of the landsliding has happened and it's literally knocked half the trees out all the way up there as well as you can see and we've just like the way that all the, the dead trees are obviously they're really great on this yellow background looks amazing uh, I just got one there but I also just got one let's see if I can find it uh, where am I where am I it's about here somewhere, I can't see it. It's there somewhere, it's there. Um, and I, I'm, 
Um, that's the one I'm interested in looking at when I get home. I think I really like it. Um, Dylan's got one as well, so I'm hoping he's got that as well. Did you get it? I think so. Yes. Um, so no, but we really need to get on and get back to this cliff. Um, it's actually turning into quite an exciting little trip because we don't know what we're ever going to come across. Um, so for me, there's two locations to come back to. This one and the other one that we found down there. But obviously, the, the money shot that we're after now is the sunset. Because um, who doesn't love a good sunset, let's be honest. So let's uh, still keep going. <laughs> Should we keep going? Yeah, keep going. And uh, let's, get, let's go and get this sunset. Hopefully we might see, there might be more places. for about an hour now and in our location for the sunset and it is cold it is very very cold Dylan is like literally um, wrapped up like a baby as you as we want to put it um, there has been this amazing I mean I don't know if you'll be able to see this I'll oh, see if I can darken this down there's some amazing clouds over that way uh, the sunset is looking wonderful but um, until that dips below the cliffs, um, we're not going to get much of an image because it's just way too bright, even with uh, even with some grad filters that we've got. So um, it's been a successful day. Is in a bit of a a hike and being outdoors, and we have actually reminded ourselves that there is two locations in our hometown that is really nice that we didn't know that were there. Um, we've probably got, I'd say I've got four images that I'm going to use, um, at least. So, I'm classing this as a successful, successful trip. Yes, it's cold. Um, we're gonna take one more image after this of, that once the sun goes down, of the afterglow, and uh, then we're gonna pack up and then probably go home up with him, because he's cold. He is very cold. So I'm, I'm hunkered down underneath all of this purely because it is very windy. Um, so yeah, for now I'm going to say goodbye and uh, I've hoped you liked all my images today. Um, yeah, here's the afterglow one now and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Bye.